Hello and welcome, welcome, welcome. You can see me in the bottom right here with my OBS. Uh, this is a run. This is a cook seed run, but I know that people have a lot of questions about how to mod and cook a run in, in, in Terraforming Mars. So I just wanted to say you have to jump into the game, start a solo challenge run, and quit and shut down the application, okay? And then what you need is something like Notepad++. And if you go to File, Open, and you follow this path, feel free to pause the YouTube video. Matt, like, oh no, my name. Uh, a serial box is your username or app name of the computer. App data, local low, lucky hammers. They were the original software developers of the app before Asmodee took it over to do the expansion. Terraforming Mars saves, local game save. And you can see here I have a save um, from the seventh month and the 10th month, which is October, so today. And if I take this and hit edit, you can see here local, this is that file. And you just control F for your find, find next look for the seed and you can see right there bam there's the game seed so the tricky thing is to get the game seed you need to go into something like this grab the seed uh, of an in-progress game and then you can save that number somewhere because lucky hammers or whatever the thing is will delete the save once the game is complete and done so you can replay the same scenario over and over and over again if you had a fun seed or you can share it with me and have me play through it blind but this is how you do it and you go through and you edit this number for whatever um whatever gets submitted or whatever you want to try and run again so that's how you mod the game you hit save you then open it up and let me just move this below so now here we are about to play a game submitted by Thread Pacifist on our Discord channel. Uh, I haven't linked to it in forever, but how about today will be a special day where I link to it. Oh, my lights are all off. Well, there's a little bit more brightness for you. Uh, and yeah, so let's try it today. I haven't looked at it yet. Uh, Phobolog or Helion. Not seeing... Um, I guess Helion it is. Or not Helion, sorry, Phobolog it is, because there's a Titanium production. Not knowing immediately, uh, I, I was actually expecting to be like, oh my god, so many Jovian tags or something. But, you know, maybe they are to come. Let's go ahead and grab a decent little start with... I mean, if this is going to be a big run, we know we want business networks. Let's grab this, it's fine. So we have just enough money to do basically nothing. I'm thinking now that I want to get the acquired company over the titanium mine, but that seems crazy. Maybe what we do is we start with a convoy from Europa. It's a slight overpay. Let's just get the steel, honestly, at this point, and we're going to rely on the single card draw. Didn't really hit it. Uh, but we'll grab the acquired company that will get us some actual money coming in and then do i overspend on the titanium no we're not going to so going into next gen slow first turn for phobolog but space hotels obviously uh changes the game there and we all know viral enhancers is good so because we know this is a cook seed and that's the one advantage i really have over my predecessor is i i know this is going to be a big game so i can be a little bit more aggressive and grabbing different cards but i can also w go way off the deep end and accidentally grab way too many cards that i really shouldn't be grabbing because it's not that cooked uh towing a comet on the hand is fantastic love the card draw um so yeah so we're gonna try and middle of the road this stuff here we have no energy production we have no energy production but we can grab these we'll leave predators it's a one point animal but a little too early to be thinking about the one point animals not to city is it i can't actually see yeah there's nothing beside it as is we're gonna let that one sit i'm not sure how we're gonna get the oxygen up this game but Look at a card. Lycan is probably worthwhile. 
Then what we're gonna do is spend seven dollars to flood for two titanium. That titanium's worth eight, and that will let a let a, that will allow us to tow a comet. Um, and maybe I should be waiting for optimal arrow breaking a money back and heat back on space events i knew the game was going to be cooked it's my own fault for having played how many so far one two and three space events that's nine dollars and nine heat that we could have had from optimal arrow breaking let alone the discounts we might get in the future but even though i know it's cooked sometimes you still got to play that card because Having pumped the, like, I got an ocean in the first round, that gave me $2 so far, soon it'll give me 3 Like, I probably, that $3 negates the money I would have gotten back later on in the game. Same thing with, anyway, I'm not going to go too deep into it. It, it. Runs like this, you definitely can wait, especially when you get media group. Now there's no question that my run would have been amazing had I just not played those cards, but let's play a little honest here. Solar power is good because we know we need energy. Large convoy, perfect. Um, solar power into fuel factory gets us more titanium, more production, uh, more good times, really. Uh, science is likely to be something we need. And when you get optimal arrow breaking, a lot of the time you do need uh caretaker contract to use up that extra energy or that extra heat but I'm not seeing it do we have any science tags no we could lose a point on the heat trapping we do have three oceans so nitrolithic moss is actually playable let's let's grab up the the dinky productions here Oh, I, I meant to play Viral Enhancers first. That hurts. That hurts. I could have an extra plant. Well, let's uh, let's just do it in energy production instead then. Oh, I should have looked at a card. Oh, research. Of course we got research. So that means that all of a sudden, uh, the misplays. Oh, oh, all of this is so good. Even Micro Mills is good and we need the heat. But I'm kind of in the camp of let's... um. Let's just play as much science as we can, as fast as we can. Yep, development center it is. So let's draw a card. And I keep forgetting I should look at the card first and see if I want to buy it. We have a lot of titanium kind of pooling up now. We're really looking for some space events. Perfect. Do we need an oxygen bumper? Nah. Like we do, but we, we're not gonna. Don't worry about it. Um I don't have any discount cards that I'm ready to play just yet. I do have AI Central, but I think instead let's just build our synergy here. Use up some of this titanium that we've been pooling up. And um, overspend a couple of times. That's fine. No, you know what? I, sh I, I should have drawn a card first. Open City is powerful, but it's not helping us this instant. We do need this energy. That almost made AI Central playable. Because I don't want to lose my energy production right now. I guess we gene repair because it's good points and good money. And then we get just a little bit more energy coming in. Even though the plant income would have been nice. Let's take that. This is something to do with my space tags. This is something... To, uh, I One point animals are so good. And I know I need them. It's just, when are we going to find the time? Uh, I'm not sure. It's tricky. Satellites is nice. Uh, how nice is satellites? Four income. Okay, well, we can bump that up. So we play this. I mean, we could have a space discount around the corner. There are so many of them in the deck, but... Uh, 
Okay. I need I need to play the science tags because AI sent like we can play anti grab. We have the science tags we need, so we just need to to play it. It's just been tricky because AI Central is so expensive, and you have to play that first. Let's uh let's draw cards if we can get like just a wild tag or something. Okay, well, there we go. Draw two more cards. Moss is very powerful. Oh, and now look at all this synergy on the plants. I didn't even realize. Plant, 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 plant. Um, lichen, titanium. Like, I can place this greenery for two steel and a couple bucks. I could go into this plant bed. Just try and greenery away. I think we just greenery away. I don't think I'm playing into the synergy of how cooked this seed is. Water import from Europa is nice, but we don't even have that much going on. Oh, well, we got a lot of card draw. We got to say that. So a little bit more money back, a little bit more. Okay. Take it all back. I take it all back. I take it all back. We are going to be just fine. This this seed is cooked. We got Earth catapult right there, and we got income per Earth tag, which is tricky because like, do you play it now? You could. You can't fault me for wanting to. Hmm. One more, like, I'd rather have five income four times for $20 than six income three times for 18 But I get $2 off if I play it after Earth Catapult, so it does come out in the wash. Like, it's, it's fine. I think we just save our money, get the Earth Catapult next turn. Do I have the plant tags? I don't but I could, but how, how far away I am from you? You have exactly enough. Yeah, I just, I just need to wait one turn. Do I need a wild tag? I don't think I do. Ah, uh, yeah, I do. Okay, you never know. Uh, because I I'm gonna get the income back. So Earth catapult first makes the wild tag free. Makes the. Uh, we should play business contacts first. Electro catapult, I think, is the way to go, even though plantation is so nice. Okay, so that's all been played. Why do you even grab IO? Like, it's not even that good. I have enough plant tags because of the wild tag. Let's draw more cards. Let's just keep drawing cards here. What are we going to do? I don't want that one. We have so much to do now. Just the way I played this, I don't have enough money to accelerate through the end game. Okay, let's play our... Like, this is $10 a turn worth of titanium is what's killing me right now. But this gets us the heat bump, gets us another heat bump, gets us the 2TR, gets us those plants that we need. I think you got a nitrogen rich. Yeah, then you... You just you just play as much as you can now. You need the cartel that gets you up to a million dollars basically, as far as I'm concerned. 
and then everything costs like three or four bucks so you lichen up and you have peroxide take some okay we're fine, we're fine, we're gonna be fine. Ice Asteroid, that's what I'm talking about. Kelp Farming, Cupola. I mean, I already have so many things to play. Like, and you just keep shoving amazing cards at me. Uh, that's not a good one. I mean, it's a space event, don't get me wrong, but. Rover Construction. Oh, I didn't even play Electro Catapult last time. Oh my God. I guess I get to use it three times, so I still get $21 from it. But still, like, it's like, that's where we're at right now. Did I even grab the titanium? I did, okay. What a tricky nightmare hellscape I've created for myself. This, like, I'm worried if I play IO Mining, I lose. Because I just don't have the money for it. I only have one Jovian. It's only going to make me $10 twice. I don't I think it's a trap. I think I'm being baited. I think I'm being baited. <laughs> oh, I hate it. I hate it cuz I can't play it. I don't want to play it, but I can't. I know I know that I'm being tested here. I will play my 2 point thing. I need so much terraforming to do. Like I'm, I absolutely cannot play it. Oh, oh my god, that hurts! It hurts so bad. I have so many discounts too. I haven't even played uh, half the things I want to be playing, like Mars University and stuff. Right? Four bucks for a card cycle, and then a card cycle on every science tag. I think instead you got to play something like Ice Asteroid. And then black polar dust. And that gets you into kelp farming. Uh, but before kelp farming, we try and get a little bit of money. Then we play. Ecological zone. Because that goes for a bunch of money. Yeah, we can enhance it for half point animals. That's totally fine. And then the kelp farming. Now, is there a way? Oh, I do have enough for shuttles. That's amazing. Okay. Um, I'm gonna grab a plant for now because we're not making city spots because we're just trying to win. Like I got handed a cook seed and I've played it so poorly that we're struggling to like get out, get through it. Like, that's amazingly bad. It's so bad. I don't know, maybe they had highlight drawn, but this seems like it's a cooked seed. Like, I can feel that it's cooked, but I'm absolutely not playing it in a way that would make a person understand that it's cooked. It has all the right ingredients. I've just played them all in the wrong order. Or not trusted that the cards, the discounts are coming, so just, just chill out. I didn't grab the one point animals because I was too stressed. Okay, well, big asteroid is a big win. Then two titanium into here makes this really good. Oh wait, did I have a mangrove? I do, don't I? Yeah, I do. Crap, 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 crap. Because I did want a cupola city beside that. Get us over here. Get all greeneries going. That gets us a heat bump. That gets us a heat bump. Like, we're in a good spot. But we should be, like, ten times better. And I didn't even play rovers. Oh, my. Ah, there's too much going on here. My brain has melted. And we've gone into the abyss. I don't even know why I bought that steel income. Well, I do. Because it technically is is fine. Um, I need two oceans. I can get that from my water and ports. And from the fridge on the track. I have $40. Okay, let's do a little bit of cycling. Because we know we're not playing you. 
I do like that. Large convoy is fine, but I still don't have a one point animal. We're on a break point, so playing my keep trying to play the med lab here is not working. It's symbiotic fungus because I have nothing to pump. Oh, I do have fish. Okay, I did I did grab the one point animal. Okay. We're just not there. Oh, and there's birds. Okay. I don't have two heat bumps, right? I could keep seeing that I have one. But without playing large convoy, I definitely don't have two. One, two. There's only three cities on the board. Do I just get rid of Isle Mining? Like, let's just do it. I, I don't want to see it. I don't want to see it. I bought it, and I feel disgusted with myself. Because I had so many better options. Instead, I grabbed it because I just felt like I wanted to be a dummy. That's how it feels. Two bucks for that? Eh, I, don't, I don't think so, man. Immigrant city for two plants. Don't need to play it now. We'll just lightning harvest. It's fine. Okay, so we have one more generation to do all of the terraforming. That's like a lot. It's a lot. I'm not feeling super hot about it, to be honest. I should have grabbed that oxygen bumper. I didn't know that we were going to be... Oh, greenhouses. That helps. Okay, look at a card. Protected Valley. That helps. Sell a steel. Look at a grab a card. Grab some more cards. Okay. Technically, this is net zero if I play it because I get three bucks back, but I could make another dollar by just selling it instead. Oh, man. How badly we've <laughs> mucked this up will go down in history. I wanted it all. I did. Now I'm, you know, falling so far. Oh, my God. I had Lake Marineris. What did I? What else? How did I get my oceans then? I flooded for them. Ice asteroid, black polar. I mean, I wasn't going to not play black, uh, Ice Asteroid and imported Hydrogen, so I think I just screwed up because I could have played... Uh... Yeah, Lake Mariners is a hard one in this one. It's like an amazing card, but it's just tricky to get out. Okay. Trees, birds, greenhouses, protected valley. Like, There's a lot of good here. I think I just large convoy, and I don't do it for one point animals. Like, <laughs> sorry, boo. I messed. I messed it up. I'm sorry. Like, I don't even have the heat bumps. Thank God I got uh, some last second. I mean, there's the fish, but wow. Do I have two space events? No, I only have one. Wow. Okay, immigrant city here. Greenery beside it. Greenery, there's no more oceans coming, so greenery there. Like, okay, before I grab points, let's, let's see. You pump the oxygen. Or we're good on oxygen. We just need the heat bumps. So let's let's do a physics complex here to cycle a card and really get an understanding for how boned we are. I don't think we're actually boned. Like I think we can buy it out. But oh wow, great. So I need to buy three heat bumps here. Crap. I will make a physic though. 
All right, so heat bump, heat bump, heat bump. Great, 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 great. All right, now I can go for a little bit of points though, because you get some ant. Oh, I didn't mean to do that, crap. I meant to grab a plant instead. Um, okay. Oh my god, and I played it before playing fish. I am, um, I honestly, like, I feel like I've had brain damage. I, uh, I don't feel like I've played a run this poorly in, well, I don't know, maybe I play this poorly all the time and you all are just laughing at me. Oh my god. My gut. I think we just take our points cards and run, right? Like, seriously, you, you take your advanced ecosystems. That's the three point card. It enhances. You take, I mean, I should have grabbed fish. This is a two point card for five bucks because it enhances. Ants, sure, it can eat a nothing, but it's still a microbe short from a point because I enhanced it for no reason. Birds is also two points. Ecological zone bumps up. Like, there's so many synergies here just in like the plants alone it's quite insane um am i getting a couple more plants i don't know i think yeah so we we're gonna be able to bury our city in greeneries right now as is let's sell the things that we are absolutely not available or not gonna do I don't like I don't even know with half these cards actually. Like I I don't have the money obviously, but what's better? Probably just trees. Sure. Okay, well there you go. I'm uh like this is a this is a monster game. It's it's really it is good. Like I can't get three plants from the board, so sure, I put some greeneries down and end it. Like, 39 points on cards. A lot of them are animals and, like, crazy goodness. Like, 123 points. This should have been... This should have been a 140. This should have been, like, a 150. Like, especially if you, you wait to play those space events at the very start of the game. Because that accelerates you. Like, like I said, it was going to be nine more heat and... Because it was three space events I played before having optimal arrow breaking. And and then there's the rebates later on. So anyway, it's nine heat and another $18 just by waiting on those three space events. Uh, and letting your titanium pile up anyway. Because then I spent the mid game with a bunch of titanium I couldn't spend. Like, Thread, I don't know. Maybe it's because I went in knowing it was a win. And I literally said, oh, I know it's a win. I'm going to buy this, this, and this. Ha ha, I have such an advantage because I know it's a win. No, was not was not an advantage. Uh, I think Thread said that they got 150 blind. 149, I just looked it up. So, if you think you can do better than me, if you think you can do better than Thread, having seen it, I mean, it's a little unfair. But I showed you guys how to mod. I'll be sure to link the Discord where you can ask questions. Uh, and the seed in the bottom of this video. I don't usually put much in the description anymore. But now you know. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Ciao for now.